Hi there. Today I'm going to show you a simple mass trick that will help you when you're multiplying by 5. And this is something that you should be able to do in your head. Um, and you won't need a calculator to do it. So uh, I'll just show you the, the basic principle. And the first um, multiplication we're going to do is 12 times 5. And the basic principle is to take the, the initial number and halve it, which is the same as dividing by 2 and then multiplying by 10. So 12 half 12 is uh, 6 and times by 10 is 60. And that's the that's the answer to 12 times 5 is 60. That's a fairly simple example so you can see um, what, what's happening in this uh, for this calculation. But uh, in all this is uh, things that you know you should be able to do in your head or you could be able to do in your head because it's a fairly simple calculation. It's multiplying by 5 is the same as halving it and multiplying by 10. So one that's a little bit more difficult, 36 times 5, so we'll half of 36 is 18, and we multiply that by 10, which is just a matter of taking the 18 and putting a 0 on the end. So the answer to 36 times 5 is 180 and and if the uh, same principle applies if you want to multiply by 50 22 times 50 in this example so we'll find half of 22 which is 11 and 11 times 10 is 110 but because we're multiplying by 50 rather than 5 then we've got an extra zero there so we put an extra zero on the end of our answer and our answer actually becomes 11 122 times 50 is 1,100. And I'm writing this out on a piece of paper so you can see what's happening. But this is all the sort of stuff that you uh, could be able to do in your head. And the same principle applies if you want to multiply by 0.5. So it's 76 times 0.5. So we take uh, half of 76, which is uh, 38. We multiply that by 10. And we come up with 380. And because it's 0.5, the decimal point is in one space from the right. Then we put a decimal point um, in one space on the right. So 380 becomes 38. And that's the answer to 76 times 0.5 is 38. Okay, hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye for now.